The Everglades are in peril. More than half of the once vast 1.5 million acre wetland is now gone because of decades of carving and redirecting of water to accommodate agriculture and development. And while urgent restoration projects have been launched to save it, a South Florida high school student and photographer is using his talents and social media to wake people up to the natural wonder we stand to lose if we don't all step up to protect it. His fight to save the Everglades is tonight's Don't Trash Our Treasure. Sometimes I'll just try and find the beauty right off the road. Slogging through the slough on what was a very chilly Saturday morning, Luca Martinez is in his element. For me, this is probably the, the most special spot um, in the Everglades. It's here, deep in the wild of Big Cypress National Park. Prehistoric looking. That I meet up with the 18-year-old Palmer Trinity High School senior inside the perfect awesomeness of a cypress dome. This is my my first location off trail. This is church, brother. I feel like I'm in a cathedral right now. That's it's incredible. I call it has that cathedral entrance. Yeah. It is, in fact, hallowed ground for Luca, an emerging wildlife photographer who's become an overnight champion of the Everglades. I'm connected to it, and I'm completely in love with this place. This subtropical wilderness called out to Luca during the pandemic. He's now spent the last two years exploring and documenting one of the most unique and complex ecosystems on the planet, and then posting his work on social media. His TikTok and Instagram videos have made Luca a viral sensation with millions of likes and hundreds of thousands of followers who flock to his platforms to experience the magical wonders of a place that remains so misunderstood by so many. I posted a video in here of this underwater world, the, the clear water, all these aquatic plants, and that one hit 12 million views. And people couldn't believe that this was the Everglades. People were saying this wasn't the Everglades, and I'm, that I'm lying. <laughs> what Luca was in fact doing was revealing the truth of the beauty that lies beneath. This compilation video now has over 25 million views on TikTok, but he doesn't do it for the likes. Because beyond the beautiful facade, beyond all of this beauty, beyond my beautiful videos lies the reality that, that this place that's been giving me life is dying. Indeed. For 175 years, humans have sliced and diced and dredged and diverted the historical natural flow of the Everglades watershed from Lake Okeechobee down to Florida Bay with devastating results. Now, right now, one quarter of that water makes it out. So we need people to care. Half of the Everglades are gone. Its native inhabitants, both flora and fauna, fast disappearing. And though restoration efforts are ongoing, so is encroachment and development, paving over what remains of wild Florida. With his videos, Luca is loudly sounding the alarm. I hope that my videos get people to care get people to see that this place is so much more than a swamp. It's a place that we rely on. You know, what's this place worth to you? What's the biodiversity worth to you? But more than that, what's your drinking water worth to you as a Floridian? That's why I do it. Luca now takes his message to schools, talks to kids, inspires them. More than just a photographer, Luca's a storyteller. At 18 years old, his work is now featured on the Everglades Foundation, UNESCO's World Heritage Google platform, where he hopes to engage even more people to join his mission. With his powerful images, Luca beckons all of us to give the river of grass a chance. Because you'll fall in love with, with this wild the same way I have. And that's what it's about. Because um, when you love something, you care to protect it. It's only when you love something that you'll fight for it. What gives me hope is that the wild will never stop fighting back. Never. This place is so resilient. That's what gives me hope. There is hope. Last month, the South Florida Water Management District announced a new project to redirect badly needed fresh water south to a parched Florida bay by ripping open parts of an abandoned highway inside Everglades National Park. More projects are on the way. The federal government has earmarked $447 million for restoration. That's a new record, by the way. And in January, Governor DeSantis committed to spend $3.5 billion on Everglades restoration over the next four years. If you'd like to learn more about Luca's work or get involved with the cleanup, scan that QR code right there. They'll take you directly to the Don't Trash Our Treasure section on local10.com.